Welcome to or welcome back to Coffee to Study. I am Lisa, a second year law student, and today I'll be talking about the difference between an iPad and a laptop and which one you should get for law school. So let's start your more traditional option and something you would normally pick, the laptop. It's great for multitasking and well, it runs all the programs you need and it looks professional. Without all my stickers, might I add. Anyways, so honestly, it's useful for in class to type as fast as you can and get as much stuff on a paper when you need it, if a professor decides to talk as fast as they can. So now we have option number two, the iPad. The iPad is really useful for writing notes in class. You can see that it is very responsive. This is me trying to study for my French class and write some stuff down. You can see that it takes my handwriting perfectly without any lag. The iPad also shines when it comes to PDF annotations. And this is something that you're going to do a lot. You have a lot of books to annotate and it's very easy to do it digitally because, well, you don't want to break your back. Now here comes the downside to the iPad besides the hefty price tag. Using Word is, well, mm, impossible. Let's just call it that. It is a great app, but it's really not as good as the app you would get on a computer. So, if your classes are in person, I would recommend an iPad. It is very easy to bring your books, your notes, and everything else you need. If your classes are, however, still going to be online, get a laptop and skip on the iPad for maybe another year. Now, if you would still like an iPad and a laptop, you can always opt for a Windows laptop and a cheaper version of the iPad, like this one right here. So we've reached the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and click that bell notification.